hello everyone in this lecture i am going to explain about how to draw a ladder diagram for when motor is on red light gets on and when motor is off green light gets on let us see first upload the library go to the c drive program files automation studio library and upload main library library is uploading change the document size or a page size First of all add the input and output cards then drag the rung between the input and output card I am selecting here LM Bradley to draw a ladder diagram so for The first row consists of one switch to start, one normally close switch for the stop the motor, take this one more switch for the latching purpose, go to the coils let output coil connect make connection for the contact switch and coils Now your first run is completed. Now move to the second run. Make proper connections of contact switch with the run. Create output coil. This is the output coil. When the, that get energized, motor gets on. Output coil to the normally open contact switch. Draw a new run for the red light gets on this one is draw one more new run when motor is off green light gets on here I am selecting normally close switch select output file which is connected to the green light Now we have to select switches to make system on and off. Let us say this is the start switch. I'm including your phone signs and it is clearly visible. Now select one more switch to make the system stop or motor stop. I 
I am connecting here to the input 2 start switch is connected to the input 0 and stop switch is connected to the input 2 now give power supply 24 volt and 0 volt the common power supply to the output card now select output devices now for the simplicity i am selecting flashing coil as a motor means flash coil gets on means motor gets on assume that flash coil is nothing but the motor now this is the indicator say this is the red light Select any one output for the connection of light. Green light. our green light connected to the output 6 now change the color of indicator this one is the red red light this one is the green light Here you can change the delay time also. These are the some technical specifications on the flashlight. Now here our light diagram is completed. Just we have to assign the switches to the input card and output points to the output devices. Start switch is connected to the input zero. Top switch is connected. Top switch is connected to the input two. Select input two from here. If you cut the address, and then you can see input zero and input two. Now output coil is connected. Let us say this is the status coil, which doesn't give any output. So add the one. Output 1 I have not connected any output so I have given output 1 select output 1 for the latching these are the internally connected which don't get which doesn't get any output now this one is connected to the other output 1 This coil is now giving output to the motor. Means 
when this coil get energized motor gets on here our motor gets on for first run and first second run now to satisfy our conditions when motor is on red light gets on this is linked to the motor output then our red light is connected to the output 4 select output 4 now for the green light when motor gets on means give it to the link to the motor output that is 0 at the end connect this to the green light that is output 6 when motor is on red light gets on when motor is off green light gets on here flashlight work as the motor Now if you go to the simulation now say motor is off so that green light gets on when you make the motor on red light gets on carefully see the working of ladder diagram start motor gets on red light gets on when motor is stop green light gets on again see motor is off green light gets on when motor is start motor is on red light gets on when you stop it green light gets on thank you for watching this video let us try for the more numerical based on the ladder diagram. Thank you.